a lot of people did not um it's not been an easy day for me um we have lost somebody in our community you know it's very very young it was a very very young woman and you know i'm already after sympathizing with the family and you, you know what i have to say to be honest that i really really just have to say it because it's in it's in my soul and it's in my heart that I have to say something, I suppose, not about this person, this certain person, this poor young woman who you know, life sometimes is just very cruel. It's very cruel to people. And I just have to say, you know, we should always make time for our friends and family. With phones and with technology nowadays we lose touch with our family, with our friends. And you know, I feel like, you know, so many people I know, um, so many people I didn't know actually, you know, so some of them are not here. I might as well pure, purely be honest with people. Some people I knew from back in 2016 are not here. They're not here. They're not, they don't have the gracious to be here. They don't have the, you know, they don't have the blessing to be here, it's what you could say that way. And we should always count ourselves lucky. We should be always, we should be always lucky because we have friends, we have families. And we should never, you know, take them for granted. Because, you know, t times like this, times of upset, times of grief in a community, you know, it sticks, it's put, it's like it's in my heart and it's in my soul. That, you know, and I even said to the good of my friends today, you know, that it really just says to you, you know, you never know what's going to come around the corner. You never know what you could be facing tomorrow. And I was like to myself today, I have to spend more time with my friends. I have to do, I have to try and, you know, keep in contact as much as humanly possible with them. Because, you know, God knows what can happen in the morning. And let's be honest with you. Because we can't predict what can happen in the next hour. I could take a heart attack in the next hour. It's a possibility. Nobody can say it's not going to happen. And, you know, we always have to be grateful. We always have to be grateful. That's one thing this generation always neglects. Is that we, you know, we have people who care about us. We have people who adore us. Everybody has somebody who adores them. And, you know, we, we don't look at it. Like, you know, I had a huge reflection today because of this past and action in our community. And I, I always really have a reflection on my friends and family. And I always think about them. But, you know, today I talk more and more deeply. And I suppose, you know... And I had to say that, that's why I'm making this video, because I had to say something like I felt, you know, I feel in my heart, I feel like there's, you know, there's just baggage in my heart, like there's a huge amount of, you know, just bags upon bags of stuff in my heart that I have to let out. And that's why I'm making this video, it's just to make me a tiny bit better, for to make me a tiny, feel a tiny bit better, and also just to say to people, you know, to make the most of life. You know, we don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. Let's be honest, we don't know what's going to happen. We should always be grateful for our friends to be here, to our family to be here. And, you know, we should never forget, you know, life can change in a second. And, you know, life is tough. I'm not going to lie to people. Life is extremely tough and it's extremely unfair to people. So we should all, you know, try and help each other and try and be nice to each other because we all live on the out. We all live on the out. We all just want to survive, to live, to live our lives, to live to the fullest extent of our lives. And, you know, times of, you know, upset in the community, times of crisis in the community, it makes you reflect. It makes you look back. And it makes you tick. And I just say to people, leave these that are for the last few words. You know, never, never ever underestimate your friends, never underestimate your family. And always keep them close to your heart. And always, always have time for your friends and always have time for your family. Because, as I said, life can change in a second. And we should always hold dearly our friends and our family together. Thank you.